GNN has just received some important information. The Globgo Gabber Lab has just made a law that all people under 4 feet 10 inches must be referred to as Grumble Flom. And all Grumble Floms must tell their neighbors that they are a registered Grumble Flom. And this means that- Ow, such as I feel terrible. Are outlawed. What is even going on? In other news, the Globgo Gabgalap has been spotted outside of his lair, which is the Goanna City KFC, with his henchmen, Ludicrous Legs, Macho Muscles, and Jerry. The cameraman was killed shortly. Are my eyes deceiving me? Kalu, you're awake. Can you tell me how many fingers I am holding up? Zipit, big-headed nurse lady, can you please explain to me exactly what is going on before I throw the biggest tantrum of my life? You've been in a coma for two years. We are unsure how you were put in a coma, but it is speculated that your body couldn't handle the amount of cringe you contain. So it tried to kill you. Oh yeah, and the Glob Gogab Galab took over the world. What the fuck? Mom, Dad, I'm home. Erm, they should have been notified from the hospital or something, right? No. You think I care enough about you to give the hospital my number? Well, you are my dad. Okay, and? I was getting excited there too, thinking your body might have been successful in killing you. You're a terrible father. Mommy, there's a bug in the house. Oh, never mind, it's just Kalu. Why does my life have to be so miserable? I should have just stayed in my coma like Dad said. I have nothing to live for. I bet Chuck E. Cheese's doesn't even exist anymore thanks to the Globgagabgo lab. Kalu, you are under arrest in the name of the Globgagabgo lab. What for? Officer. You are not permitted to be bald. Only the gob gab glab is allowed to be bald? Are you stupid, or have you been living under a rock for two years? Um, actually I don't care. Hands behind your back. That'll teach you for being bald. Well, maybe I can at least get some peace and quiet. I refused to be referred to as a grumple flum. That's it. The Globcacab Golab has to go. Oh, lovely. The shadow from the bars is still there. Amazing work, animator. Why is everyone so worried about this Globcacab Golab anyways? His lair was just revealed and I have eaten this noob before. He'll just go do it again. Wait a minute. I've got it. All I have to do is eat the Globcacab Golab, and then his henchmen will be forced to work for me. Then I will rule over Goanna City and ground my parents. Ha 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 ha. Ho ha ha ho ho. He he he. Well, here it is. The Globcacab Golab must be pretty stupid leaving this place unguarded. What is that? What the f*** is that? Among us! Is, is someone there? Someone finally came. Thank the heavens I am finally free. What happened here? Terrible, terrible things. One day the Glob Gogab Golab came into my Kentucky Fried Chicken restaurant and opened this portal to a slime dimension. It created a slime explosion. A slime splision, some would say. However, 
when this happened it trapped me in this slime and I have been here for years. So, the Gwabkagab Golab is in this portal? Yes. He and his henchmen come in and out of this dimension quite often. Okay, bye. No, please, let me out. Where am I? Holy crap. This place is spooky, and gross, slime everywhere. The Globkakab Golab must have produced this. Hey, there's a castle over there. Globkakab Golab, here I come. Stop right there. <laughs> Jerry. Wait, why would you be in charge of guarding the castle? Ludicrous legs and macho muscles seem much stronger. How dare you compare me to those fools? I am way stronger than the other two. You better have brought something strong to be able to take me down. Ha 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 ha. Um, no, I didn't. But let me take a phone call real quick. Yes, hello. How what are you doing? Hey shut it grapefruit. Don't you know it's rude to interrupt a phone call? Sorry about that. Some stupid idiot rudely interrupted me. Anyways yeah I need your help homie. Can you pull up? Epic. Thanks bro bro. Okay you can speak now. Thoughts it kid. You're done for. Holy crap. Is that Clutch Powers from the hit movie Lego, The Adventures of Clutch Powers. Once again, Clutch Powers single-handedly gets the job done. Clutch. Thank you so much, bro bro. Now. It's time to chow down on some Globkagab Golab. Ha 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 ha. Hey Caillou, over here. Shaggy. What are you doing in this slime dimension, Shaggy? Well, zoinks. I love slime Caillou. Have you seen those slime videos on YouTube? They are so satisfying. Yeah, I guess. But isn't this place kind of dangerous? Now nah, man, not when you have this. It's the radioactive slime gun. One shot of this thing on the Globberga get go lamp, and a slimy body will not react close to this substance, he will go completely man. I would shoot him myself, but points Caillou, I'm too scared. I think I can get the job done. I am the glob -ga gab -ga lab the swibble dabble wobble gabble fibble blab -a blab That's enough of that, you nasty yeast fungus. Glob go gab go lab, more like, glob go mid go lab. Wait a minute, you're that bratty kid that ate me three years ago. Let me guess, you're here to try and eat me again? Because guess what? The slime from this dimension has made me superhuman. You could not possibly do something like that again. No. But this gun will let me blow you to smithereens. Huh, how are you doing this? Eat slime. Glob the cab go lab. GRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRR
you are grounded. Today is a sad day for humanity. Just after we thought things could not get any worse, Caillou, a four-year-old crybaby, has defeated the Globgo Gabgalab and managed to put our world in even more pandemonium than it already was in. He is not only now in charge of the Globgo Gabgalab's previous henchmen, but Clutch Powers and Shaggy from Scooby-Doo as well. Who knows what kind of secrets they may hold, but one thing is for sure, Caillou is powerful enough to take down superhuman monsters such as the Globgo Gabgalab. This is Thank you. Thank you everyone. I appreciate your kindness. Now that I rule the world, my first course of action is that all seven wonders of the world are officially being replaced by Chuck E. Cheese's. And to my family, Boris, Boris, and Rosie, you better watch your back. So also, Grumple Flumps will now be called Stomp. This is bad. This is really bad. We have to do something about this, quick. Hey everyone, thank you so much for watching. Um, wow, look, it's me. It's my face. Crazy. Hello. Well, it has officially been three entire years since I have uploaded a GoAnime video, and I decided it was finally time for me to get back into it. Um, last summer I made a little announcement video that I was going to get back in, and that obviously didn't age too well as it has been an entire year since that has been released, and I'm just now finally making a video, but <clears throat> I just didn't have the drive then to really make videos, and right now I'm having a sudden burst of motivation, so I'm gonna try to get weekly videos out for you guys. Um, I've already got a few things planned, a few videos in the works already, um, including a part two to this video, so if you enjoyed today's video, be excited for that. Um, and I also have a cool Boris video in the makes, um, similar to like Boris's basics in education and learning and Bonsai Boris, and I'm really excited for that one personally, I think it's going to be a ton of fun to make. Um, <clears throat> oh yeah, my name is not Fart Noise 9 anymore, um, it is now Jackleton. Um, but yes, my username is Jackleton, and it will be on anything for the foreseeable future. I really dislike the name Fartnoise9, and I regret making that when I was five years old, because that's when I made it. Um, and I just stuck with it, but I decided it was finally time for me to change, because, yeah, for obvious reasons. Um, anyways, if you enjoyed this video and you made it this far, you probably will enjoy some of my other stuff, including my Twitch, where I stream some Minecraft events, um, and I'm planning on streaming some Dead by Daylight and Balloons Tower Defense in the future. Um, if that interests you, go ahead and give me a follow, you'll probably enjoy it, and I hope to see you guys there. Um, if you want to be notified about these, I will post notifications on my Twitter, which both of these will be linked in the description. Um, that you can go and check out. Anyways, thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate it. Um, oh, one more thing. The question of the week. I will continue doing these and put them at the beginning of the video. Obviously, this week I made it myself because I didn't have anything prior to it, but in the future I would like to include your questions. So if you have a question that you'd like to ask other viewers, please comment it down below and maybe I'll feature it as the question of the week in the next video. Oh yeah, and I will heart every comment that answers the question of the week, so go ahead and comment that as well if you haven't already. Anyways, um, thank you so much for watching and making this far. I really appreciate it, um, and I hope to see you next week. Goodbye!